Hey guys, what's up? Uh, this is Mukhtar and uh, today I'm gonna show you the use of static keyword in embedded C. So it's having basically two usage. Uh, first one, if you want to retain the last value of the variable in the function, then you can use it. And uh, second one, if you want to limit or restrict the scope of the function or variable, then you can use it. So let's take a look so uh, this is the uh, ad51 uh, base project in kill and uh, suppose this is the function uh, which is used to increment the counter value all right so i haven't declared the variable so let's uh, declare it doing the so this is the variable and I want it to increment every time whenever I call this but now what will happen uh, as I haven't uh, added the study keyword so what will happen whenever caller function call this uh, this variable get uh, generated in stack and its lifetime is uh, limited all right so if you want to retain its value, then what you can do, you can simply add this static keyword. Now again, what will happen? Uh, compiler uh, put this variable in, uh, uh, in different segment, which is uh, data segment. That means it will not uh, generate this variable uh, in a stack whenever call a function call it. All right. So that means it lifetime get increased and it will remain there uh, through the uh, complete time of the execution. All right. So <coughs> this is the first use. Now second one. Uh, so let's take this example. Now here this is the one function uh, init level one, and my intention is to use this function only in this file. So what I've done is uh, I've added static keyword over here and I'm calling this function inside system init. All right. So now let's take a look if I compile it, what will happen? So now you can see compilation is successful, uh, 0 at 0 warning. All right. Now let's see if I also try to call it in uh, other module. In let's see if I call it over here. Let's save it again and again. Compile it. So look, compilation is not perfect. Uh, it gives gives you the warning, and let's see what it says. Uh, it's saying uh, okay, like that name is unresolved. So, so this is it, guys. And uh, let's see if I remove it remove the static keyword so here you can see compilation is successful so that means uh, this function is getting called in main also so guys now I hope you understood uh, how you can uh, restrict the scope of the function so if you want to restrict the scope then just add static keyword now the same logic you can uh, apply for the variable also uh, for the variable like this if I, if you want to limit the scope to this file only then you can simply add the static keyword and if you by mistake try to uh, use this variable outside this file then compiler at least gives you the warning so that's it guys uh, i hope uh, this video is informative to you and uh, don't forget to subscribe it and do like it guys. Thanks.